That, uh, didn't take long at all. I guess I'm well more well prepared now than I was when I first started playing. Um, eruption is OP is what I've learned here. Eruption is absolutely out of control. I will always love you more than she or anyone else ever could. Don't know what that sound is. We are now in the void, I think. We're in question mark, question mark, question mark. Okay, that was... That was much easier than I thought it would be. I'm just going to revive, just in case, um, just in case something else pops up. I don't think there's anything else, but again, my memory could be failing me. Alright, uh, eruption OP. Got it. Uh, oh, there, oh, there's a heal spot anyways, whoops. Nothing there. Oh, well, I guess we'll just touch it. No reason not to. Ah, this is right at the beginning. Oh, right. This goes through, like, our whole journey so far. So we boarded the train. There's the train sound. Oh. There's Ame. And these are all the people that we could have been. Hey, Julia. Yep, we're gonna take on... A couple of pads. Hi, Victoria. You're not Kiki. Why did you say you're Kiki? I guess by order we meet Kane next. Oh, we choose our starter. Well, we went with Poplio. Hi, Kane. I thought we were going together. Hello. Uh, yeah, they they speak a little bit different. It's more like personal, I guess. I guess after Julia, we went... Oh, hey, Fern. Not even I was good enough. Hmm. Insecurities. Guess we go back. Oh, yep, there's another path. Hello, Florinia. Hmm. Please notice, she says. Someone just fell. Should probably. I'm gonna turn speed up off. There's Cal and Shelly. More Cal and Shelly. And that was when Cal hit Shelly. Shelly. That's Cal and Cal. It's all the blinks. More Cal and Blake. There's Chili by herself. That's Heather. Heather and Sigmund.
Oh, it doesn't actually hurt. Okay. Oh, hey, Anna. If two stars fall passing like chips in the night, do you think they would wish upon each other? If that would happen, then which wish would win? Maybe we just have to chase them to the horizon to find out. And there goes Anna. Anna seems to know what's going on here. Uh, who? Is that Luna? There's Sigmund and there's a uh, few others. Oh, hey, Kane. Listen, Kane, I want to go with you, but you're not going on the same path. Which direction do we go here? Oh, I don't think it matters, does it? Hello, Kiki. And she's dead. Oh, sh Hmm. That's Kiki's inner mind, I guess. Uh oh, Aya and Kane. Hmm, not a great household, I see. But I guess we already kind of knew that. Cory up there. A few others down here I don't quite recognize. I assume people from Kane's past. Hey Kane. Uh no, not really. Alright, I'll see you around, Kane. Or maybe not. Uh, oh, these are... Wait, are these blonde heathers? Or is that Luna? I think these are blonde heathers. Lizzie, Lizzie. I think that's his wife's name. Any of you talk to me? Okay. Oh, hello, Lin. Uh, this is all the way at the, um, all the way back, like, right before Adrian's gym, and still more of this. This is not in the right order. Elias. Lots and lots of Elias. Is that Randomus and Luna? And there they go. Once upon a time. Who is this? Once upon a time, a belt of meteors swept across the universe. But one day, one of those little meteors decided she wanted to go further than any of the others ever had. So she kicked up her trail, revved up her space dust, and off she went, sailing far, far away across the galaxy. Further than all her best friends. Further than all her loving family. Further than any meteor had ever known it was possible to even go. 
and when she was very, very tired of flying so far away, she found a little planet she liked, and she thought that she would finally rest. So the little meteor started to descend to the planet's surface. But that planet's atmosphere was so hot and so thick that the little meteor was and the little meteor was so exhausted from flying so many millions and millions of moons across space that she burnt right up in the sky. And do you know what happened? All the people that on that planet looked up and they said, Look, a shooting star. Let's make a wish. And so everyone on that little planet, which has scarcely seen such a star in its life, wished and wished and wished and wished with all their might. And those people smiled and knew hope like they have never known before, and felt happy. But by the time, and by the time it would have come to the surface, there was nothing left of the little meteor there was nothing of the little meteor left at all. It had all, poof, vanished. And even though it disappeared from the world forever, do you know what that little meteor did? It lived happily ever after. Is your hair black? It, in the joy it brought, in the hearts it touched, and the smiles it inspired in its mo final moments as a shooting star. And even with its last little itty bitty bit of life, it never ever regretted what it had done, even once. So make sure to smile for me too, okay? You could have been a meteorite instead. What was that? I guess Randomus's wife, maybe? That's a Ralts, Curlia, and Randomus, I guess. And Gossip Gardevoir? That's the Team Meteor logo. Luna, Bennett, Elias, Anna, Noel, Radimus, Gossip Gardevoir, and Sarah for some reason. Taka, Luna, and Solaris, Elias. Oh, uh, fathers and their children. Hehehe, <laughs> this is funny. Hey, don't you even know who your real ally is? Don't you? Don't you? Hey, who's really made it so you could get this far? Who? Who? Hey. Haven't you been having fun? Haven't you? Haven't you? So you're like me. Hehehe. <laughs> Why else would you keep playing? I have no idea who that is. Ah, uh, the lower case gives me and that's a hypno. Do I fight you? Oh, I do fight you. Okay. Level 100. Let me light screen. Oh, it's gonna hypnosis. Dream Eater. Okay. Uh, I don't know what type it is. All mind. Huh. Light screen faded. Oh, that's not great, is it? Yeesh. Yeesh. Um. Eruption? Nope. Okay, so it's dark psychic, I guess. Yeah, it looks like dark psychic. Judging by how much damage that did. Um. Okay, flinch is, flinch is OP. <laughs> Good job, Chinchino. Uh, is there a heal spot? I'm gonna save, just in case. Okay, we got rid of Hippo's Hypno. I didn't even check its uh, full stacks. Yep, it is Psychic Dark, no guard. Oh, so there's no chance of missing anyways. Digitally lobotomized for full efficiency, its function is perfect control. It projects its unconsciousness onto target locations and can directly manipulate up to two individuals at a time. 
So it can uh, hypnosis a wide area, but it can only control two. Sarah, broken in half. And Bennett. Laura, Luna, Sarah, and... Is that Bennett again? If this is what it's like to die, I don't mind. I'm happy. I was finally able to be of use to my master, and that feeling is my own. My own. No matter how intensely I may feel it, even I know the truth. All my desire for him is just a reflection of his own longing for her. And neither of us could ever realize it. After all, a human marrying a Pokemon? How gosh, unthinkable. These aren't the Dark Ages anymore. I'm not stupid, just a mess. And even if I put all of those thoughts square out of my head, I know they would all come rushing back the moment I saw him again. Is that just how crushes are? Or is just part of my fate only to have his feelings? I suppose I'll never find out. Not anymore. For now, I would rather like to sleep for a very, very long time. Oh, Terra. Are you... alive? Hmm. Uh, this is the water plant. It's better this way, but you're not the one who gets to decide that. Oh, that's Ace. Oh, he's still there, just invisible. Cal. Oh. Oh, this is when he pushed him off it at Ametrine. How much longer do we have to stay out here? As long as a rope. What? How long is a rope? As long as it needs to be, huh? I was just tired. Stop making excuses. I didn't mean to ruin anything. If you're really tired, then go sleep. Here in the snow? No, in the luxury down bed, yes, out here. Dad won't be mad after this, right? He will if you keep asking things like that, but I'm still cold. Yes, that's kind of the point. I want to go inside. Stop complaining. It's your fault we're in this situation in the first place. Hmm. Uh, hello, Shade. Um, what's that? Was that Cal? Oh, I think a lot of people just died. I think that some of those were Ame, Amethysts, and Ame. Uh, is that Zero? Zell? Zero, Lumi, and Evelyn? That's an Aegis Slash. Oh, that's Lin's. Okay, that's back at the fairy tale field. At Never After. Enough. Oh, hello there. Luna? Real Luna? How do you do, Thumbs? It's been a fair few moments since our last visit, has it not? Uh, last I saw you was at Iolia Valley, which was like six badges ago but let us not linger on this i fear you have dallied far too long as is uh i guess we can go all right uh see you luna oh wow what happened here and Elias. Oh, it's Randomus.
Nurse Rejoimus. Uh, uh huh. Uh, do you guys need a moment? Um, yeah, please explain. And so Luna, Gardevoir, and, uh, And Sarah. I guess to Luna, this is more like uh, two parenting figures, supposedly. How old is Luna, by the way? Uh. Okay, so those three will... Yeah, yeah, happy little family going on here. Um, Shade. Oh, Shade is... Uh, Okay. <laughs> uh, yes. Speaking of uh, protagonists, yep, elevator was our doing. Um. Oh, and we gave him the sapphire bracelets, I guess. Oh, well, you joined up with a religious organization. Okay. Are they together? Uh, okay, hello. Um, our cycling is happening. Uh, You have claimed to have changed sides, you have chosen your side. And we defeated Luna. That was her We Vow Umbreon team. Last time a man asked me that, he left the arena crying. Uh, Full restores incoming. And we still beat them. Uh...
Is this like what what is going on here? Is Bennett uh Uh-oh, here we go. Uh-huh. A black hole is coming. I assume it's too late. And that's how we ended up in a black hole with Luna coming in to save us. If you've ever walked into a class late, then you will know what it's like. Heads turn, eyes peel. You think of a thousand things that they did not but feel them all the same. In that moment, you are the sole star in the sky. And they are trying to sleep. Expectation and anxiety are frequent guests at an otherwise unplanned tea party, and while their sugar sits untouched, the sun is setting far too slowly. Never soon enough, and it will be time for them to go along their way. They will retire for the evening, home to their wives, to their children, children who grow tired, children who grow up asleep, but still you must peel their eyes. There comes a time in every child's life where they must lay down their teaspoon, pinch the corners of a fabric, and pull the tablecloth right away, enough, she says, and follows the lights out. When there is only one path, there is only one way to go. And when, in the darkness, the path cannot be seen at all, then you are free. For now, my own time has come for me to follow my own infinity. Farewell, mother. Farewell, father. It has been like a dream. I guess we won't see Luna again for a bit. No, 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 no. Why? Why? Why did control, control, right? Incompetence. And he's out. Oh, and Laura's awake. Uh... Wow, Laura is uh, way too nice for her own good. I guess those two are going after Zell. Oh, Shade delivered us. And this is how we got back right to the beginning of the cutscene. Unbelievable. And we're back to the present. Alright. 
Hello, Anna. Hello, Noel. Uh Oh, oh yeah, I remember now. They're random as his kids. Wow, okay. Uh No moss, uh, painter and fantasia. Uh, the <laughs> Caroline and Monty, but uh, Heather, no wait, Molinar, I forgot who Molinar is, but uh, there was one for Heather. Oh, uh, Charlotte's. Safira was the eldest daughter. Yep. And so Randomus's wife disappeared. Ah. Uh, oh, the amethyst pendant is back. Yeah, I guess these three have always been ones. Well, at least Randomus and Anna have always been uh, going with the flow. Noel, sometimes. <laughs> Okay, uh... Yeah, Kane is gone. I'm kind of... I don't remember. It, is Kane gone gone? Because I'd be pretty sad. Oh! Wait, was this an E... Wasn't it... Was this an E18? Oh yeah, we opened the thing and I was like, you're not them. Ah, uh, the power cycles. Yeah, I guess Kane is still... Luna can probably still find Kane, maybe? Hello, Shelly. Welcome back. Oh, and uh, Hardy's here.
Yeah, we'll go with you guys. All the way to Kalsanon. We are back. Uh, we're finally back. Hey, Shelly. Um, yes, Kane is... Hello, Eve. So Eve is purple and Lumi is blue. Okay, uh, Pulse Mine, Pulse Claw with Sir, Pulse 2, and Arc Pulse. Okay, Pulse Mine. Uh... Right, so, uh, Power Grid. It's super defensive, okay. Uh, so zero is allowed to pass through, but not, um... Let me heal. Uh, I think this house is where we're supposed to be. Hey, Charlotte. Oh, Aster, hello. Sorry about that. A shiny charm. I mean, I'm sorry it took your life to t make that happen, but... And you three? Uh, so he's just... Playing with uh, there's nothing here. Oh, hello, Lumi. Okay, so let's go into that house. Yo, thumbs. Uh, all right. So what's happening? Shield is here. Agate City we go, and hope this place doesn't burn down. Uh, Charlotte is here, Randomus is here, Noelle is here, Anna's here, uh, as well as even Lumi. So, they should at least be able to hold. Alright, I'm gonna end this episode here because it's gonna be a two-parter one. Next time, into Agate City we go. See you all in the next episode.